You may have watched many medical TV shows, but let's face it, no show can be as iconic as Grey's Anatomy, and no couple could ever be as loved as Meredith and Derek. Even though Derek has been missing for some years now, fans still can't stop shipping them. In this video, we'll talk about the overlapping storylines of the couple, which happen to be at different points. Stay tuned to find out the details. First and foremost, how did the couple end up in jail in the first place? The main on-screen couple, despite being renowned surgeons, ended up in jail, but on different different occasions for different reasons. So Grey's Anatomy repeated the same story with Meredith and Derek just in varying scenarios. Neither of the two, Meredith Grey, Ellen Pompeo, and Derek Shepard, Patrick Dempsey, were the calm, unproblematic people you meet in your everyday lives. Both were opinionated, passionate, and quite the characters themselves, which eventually led to consequences. Even though Derek was called McDreamy by many people in the hospital, owing to his dreamy eyes, handsome face, and charismatic personality, there was nothing dreamy me about ending up in jail. You might be wondering, what could your favorite fictional neurosurgeon have done to end up behind bars? Well, in season six, Derek survives a shooting, his wife's miscarriage, and being shot straight in the chest. That's a whole lot of trauma to go through at one time period. To cope with this unfortunate set of events, he started speeding and many times ended up in jail for breaking the law. Meredith usually bailed him out, but eventually got fed up with his usual misconduct. So one time, she decides to leave him overnight, so he changes is his unacceptable behavior. Not just Dr. Shepard, but Meredith also ended up behind bars in season 16, but it was for completely different reasons. Her storyline was much more complicated and serious than just crossing the speed limit. Let's look in detail at both of these unlikely events that led to our beloved couple in the last place we'd expect them to be, behind bars. Following up, the tragic shooting in Seattle Grace Hospital in season 6. You might be wondering, a shooting in a hospital? Isn't that a bit too extreme? Well, well, all sorts of tragedies take place in Grey's Anatomy, Seattle Grace Hospital. This includes a bomb inside a patient's cavity, Meredith nearly drowning to death, and a plane crash. One of his toughest moments was indeed the shooting. This tragedy took place because of Gary Clark, who appeared at the hospital to avenge his wife's death. According to him, his beloved wife would have been alive if the doctors at the hospital had just followed his wishes. Just a few weeks ago, Gary's wife was just another patient at the hospital. She had cancer and after suffering a stroke, was put on on a mechanical ventilator, a machine that was breathing for her and keeping her alive. According to the doctors treating her, this was against the patient's wishes, and so despite Gary's objections, the machines were turned off. Gary was furious at this and went on to sue the hospital, claiming they were responsible for his wife's death. While the lawsuit was pending, Gary took an extremely dangerous step and showed up at the hospital with a gun and ammo. He shot multiple people, including our hotshot surgeon, McDreamy. This led to Meredith going into extreme shock and grief. The stress, anxiety, and uncertainty of the whole scenario caused her to miscarry her first child, which is no small loss. The trauma from this event was enough to make Derek follow extreme measures, such as speeding, which eventually landed him in jail. Not to mention, Dr. Gray ended up in jail too, but for a very different reason. There's a reason the general surgeon is loved by many, and that is her empathetic nature. Despite going through many traumas herself, Meredith never stopped being kind and goes out of the way to help her patients. She takes all that pain, all that that darkness and turns it into light and helps those around her, despite their social standing. It was no surprise when the surgeon was willing to risk her job to save a patient's life. A young girl, Gabriela Rivera, was diagnosed with lymphoma and required surgery, along with years of treatment and follow-ups. The twist? She didn't have the medical insurance to get her surgery covered. Meredith, to save her life, went ahead and enlisted Gabriela as her own daughter, so the insurance would cover the expense of surgery. It all seemed like a doable plan, until Meredith got caught and was fired for committing insurance fraud. She also got stripped of her medical license and ended up in jail. Things got to the point that her friends and colleagues had to testify in her favor. She was released on Halloween, but had to appear in court to get her medical license back. By the time Meredith went to jail, Derek was no longer a part of the show, but the writers ended up giving the show's main couple the same story, just with different contexts. Coming up, what's the hype around Grey's Anatomy? And what is its story? Medical dramas have continued to be really popular among the audiences, such as The Good Doctor, The Resident, New Amsterdam, and House. However, nothing quite beats Grey's Anatomy, a show that is about to mark two decades soon. Created by Shonda Rhimes, the medical TV series has won the hearts of its viewers by providing a combination of medical cases, drama, and comedy. The characters are relatable and have personalities everyone is bound to love. The show follows the lives of its workers, mainly the surgical interns, residents, and attendings, as they struggle to balance their personal and professional lives. 
lives. However, their storylines end up overlapping, which creates a lot of drama both inside and outside the hospital. Leading Grey's Anatomy is Meredith Grey, who starts her journey at Seattle Grace Hospital, now called Grey Sloan Memorial Hospital, as an intern. She goes a long way and eventually becomes the head of general surgery at the same hospital. That is indeed quite impressive. Throughout many seasons, we witness Meredith evolving a lot as a person and as a doctor, but we also see her enduring many tough moments, many of which were devastating to see. One major part of her life that was always filled with a lot of bumps was her relationship with Derek. The two, despite being brilliant surgeons and very much in love, faced a lot of challenges and, like a power couple, learned to face them together. This brings us to a very important lesson. Love is not always rainbows and sunshine. It can be tough, too. Let's learn more about how the couple fell in love, despite having a rocky start. Even though we all loved Meredith and Derek together, we've got to admit they didn't have the smoothest start to a relationship. The couple always had undeniable chemistry. They had an unexpected one-eye stand after meeting in a local bar, and then the very next day, to their utmost shock, found that they both worked in the same hospital. Meredith was starting her job as a new intern, and Derek was attending, making him her boss. The two, despite many oppositions from their co-workers Bailey and Weber, were drawn to each other and eventually started dating. However, more challenges awaited the couple when Meredith, in the finale of season one, found out that the love of her life was married to Addison Montgomery, Kate Walsh. What a twist! Even though Addison and Shepard had separated, Derek had kept this a secret from his new girlfriend, and Meredith was furious. Heartbroken, she shut him off, with Derek trying to reconcile things, but in the end, choosing to stay with Addison. Phew, that's a lot of drama. After a lot of drama, going back and forth, the two eventually realized that their love for each other was too much and found their way back to each other. They got married, had a family together, and did have some wonderful years being hitched. Like every couple, they did have their challenges, but always found their way back to each other's arms. Sounds pretty romantic, right? Finally, Meredith's roller coaster journey in Grey's Anatomy. The medical drama hasn't been very kind to its lead actress, that's for sure. Meredith had her fair share of unfortunate events, which includes accidentally sleeping with her boss, discovering that the guy she loves has a wife, her one-night stand having priapism, and ending up at the very hospital she worked in, her embarrassing one-night stand with her friend George, and many more. Some more serious events include her mother having Alzheimer's and eventually dying from it, her husband being shot right in front of her eyes, nearly drowning to death, and ending up in a plane crash. Despite all these tragedies, Dr. Gray continued to be an embodiment of kindness, compassion, and resilience, inspiring others never to let life and its unexpected events steer them away from their path to greatness. That's why we love Meredith, because she gives us hope and leads us to believe in the goodness of this world when it has nothing but darkness to offer. What are your favorite Meredith moments from the show? Feel free to let us know in the comments down below. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel for all the latest news. Until next time.